there friends and welcome back to Strange Rebel Gaming. I'm Brianna White and today on this most lovely day we'll be playing another episode of Final Fantasy 7 Remake. Let's see, what did we just finish? We just finished doing all of the Shinra building combat simulations. I'm really loving the combat and I know I say that a lot but I really cannot overstate what an amazing job they did with it. Um, just so fun, just genuinely so fun and you can really lose yourself into it and uh, hours go by and all of a sudden you're like, wow, what time is it? Um, not that time is a thing anymore because it certainly isn't in 2020. Anyways, so we have some exciting stuff coming up in this episode, so take a second before we begin to hit the like button and we'll get on to this gameplay video. Enjoy! Okay, engage gameplay mode! What are we even, what's the, what are we even doing here? Let's, let's reacquaint ourselves with this guy. I'm counting on you to change Shinra. Well, you might be disappointed there, my friend. I hope you will continue Chadley, to help me gather I have defeated all of the combat simulations. And yet, I have not unlocked any new materia. So... What's your deal? What's the point of you being here, I sir? I look forward to receiving all of your future battle intel submissions. I don't quite understand what his deal is. Um, let's, I think we had completely messed up all of our materia. So let's just make sure that we're all good here. So far, I like everything I see. Ice barrier, wind, HP up, AP up, synergy, lightning, first strike, auto cure, chakra, time healing, magnify. Yeah. Oh, you need an update, my friend. Yes, you do. I took a bunch from you. You could use an MP up materia if we've got a spare one. You could use that for sure. Yeah, let's give you an MP up materia. Healing materia, love that for you. Ice, also love that. Um, prayer, magic up, great. I wonder if we could give you something that would do well with your abilities. You already have a healing, okay. Might be, let's do this tentatively. AP up materia, chakra, chakra, assess, prayer, prayer, steal, HP up, HP up, MP up, magic up, magic up, luck, first strike, auto cure, provoke, I kind of might kind of like cleansing for her. Um, I love the idea of an Essena. I think I would use it. Oh, revival, duh. I always forget revival materia, always. I don't know why, but that's like a, that's like a necessary materia going forward. I don't know why I always forget to equip that. Maybe because it's green and it always, I don't know. I almost want to switch Tifa off the AP up. Wait, who has the AP up? You, Barrett. Oh, I like that too. But I kind of want to level up Revival. Okay, so let's give Aerith the AP up. Come back! Yes. And then put Revival in. Where did you go? Revival materia. Always escaping me. Okay, yeah. So that'll... Okay, it's gonna take forever. We're probably gonna finish the game before this ever levels up. But, you know, it is what it is. 
and we never use it. We just, we don't, we don't really ever use it. But what did we sacrifice here? Ice. Okay, but ice is already equipped by someone else, Barret. So instead of HP up, now Barret can have something useful like. Oh, HP absorption. So no one's using that right now. So let's give him HP absorption and link that with ice. That way, he every time he unleashes an ice attack, he regains HP. It's not bad. It's not bad as far as like, we removed the HP up materia AP bonus link. I'm happy with it. We're good, we're good with that. I'm also just very glad that we caught up with that. Okay. Yeah, stools are lame. Should we sit on this bench? Should we do that? Yeah, let's sit on this bench. Okay. Now the question really is, we kind of, uh oh. Uh. Cloud? Huh? You're what? Cloud, right? Oh. Holy shit! It's cool, bro. We went through training together. Damn. So you're still alive and kicking, huh? Some of the guys heard you got smoked, but I told them it was all bullshit. Hey, sit tight, man. I'm gonna go get Kunzel. I'll be right back. Oh, buddy. You okay? Yeah. But you were just... I'm good. Let's keep moving. Yeah, you're gonna not want to be there when that guy comes back. That's probably my guess. Um... Wow. Okay. Uh, so that kind of threw me for a loop. I wasn't really expecting that. I thought we were in for a battle. But luckily we avoided it. Um, because that guy remembers that Cloud is a soldier. Hope you get him soon. Ex soldier, and thought he was still buddy buddy with him. What an interesting memory. And then that really set off Cloud's glitchy head thing that he's got going on. Um, okay, so I don't really know if there's anything else to do around here, but, you know, screw these chairs. That's what swords are for. Um, reconnaissance mission. Okay. So let's follow what the map tells us to do. Hmm. I'm guessing that we should be safe here, right? that's not where we're supposed to be. Um, but now I can't remember how I get there. Do I have to go up a level? Ooh, yes. I trust the narrative is intact. Rock solid. The people have embraced the Wu-Tai Avalanche conspiracy wholeheartedly. I've almost come to believe it myself. Wu-Tai's response? So far, nothing. And if those cowards do react, all the better for us and our story. Very well. Then we shall stay the course. If I may, sir, there was one other matter. Oh? A message from our man, Palmer. Okay, so they're heading up to the tippy-top floor. Aaron. Yeah, yeah, I know. We came here to save Eric. That's our first priority. That's right. That's we right. We only get one chance. 
Hojo should be at that board meeting, so that'll buy us some time. We need to plan this just right. We can't mess it up. Now, do I take the elevator? Apparently I do. Apparently I take the same, nope. The same elevator, yeah. Apparently I take the same elevator that they just took. What happens when we get up there and the doors are like, ding, and there, they're standing right there. What are we gonna do? Get in the elevator. Tifa, come on. Okay. Now, I think we go to 69? Nice. Um, I don't know. I guess this is where we're going. You do not have access we're not going there. Yeah, we're not going there. We, we don't want to go there. But we were already on 64, or maybe we weren't on 64. Maybe we need to get to 64. Well, there's nothing on this landing at all. Okay, that's insane. Look at this nonsense. The up is on the left until you're here, and then the up is on the right? You can't just switch it like that. That's offensive and confusing. Okay, here we are in the conference rooms. Now, how is this any different from where we just were? Let's find out. Well, you got a little thing here. What does this do? Nothing. Okay. Interesting. I guess we're go- Oh, there's the president! I definitely don't want to get seen by him. Definitely, certainly don't want that. Do you think that's where Professor Hojo is? Where he should be. Now, here's the thing. We're, we're doing some sort of, like, secret reconnaissance, we don't want to get caught kind of thing. This receptionist is right there! She's totally seeing us! This is not very sneaky at all. What do you have to say, ma'am? An important meeting is in session. Well, that was extremely useful. What's the plan? Little bit of recon. Need to find a way to infiltrate that room. You hear the words coming out of your mouth. We just gotta find that bathroom so we can get into the air duct. Ask anyone here. They can point us in the right direction. No thanks. We can find it on our own. Cloud, why do you have to intentionally make everything more difficult for us? Like, can we not have anything be easy? Let's go into this room. Didn't have the staff. Yeah. Let's see what there is to see in here. Nothing. That's what I thought. Oh, lady, you have a problem. Um. Hey, sir. The mayor. I don't have time to talk. What? Why? Because you're so busy sitting here staring at me? I didn't even want to talk to that guy, but now I want to take up all his time. Dark conference room. This looks like it would be very cold with air conditioning. Why do corporate buildings always have the AC set to like four degrees? That's the real question. Do you have time to talk? Are you allowed to be hanging out here on the clock? I'm not hanging out. I'm on a mission. These guys are so sassy. Did you see Sector 7? I can't bring myself to look. I went to the Skyview Hall. It's worse than I imagined. So they're discussing a reconstruction plan in the meeting? Yeah. Director Tuesti was preparing a proposal. Hmm. Hmm. Highly suspicious in my opinion. 
Oh, they have the shades drawn here. Interesting. What do you all have to say for yourselves? Are you gonna yell at me and be rude too? Uh, sir, are you sure you should be here right now? There is a meeting going on, you know. There may be a yeah. meeting or two going so, uh, on. Wait, he's talking to that person? The smell coming from the bathroom. It's leaking into the main conference room, remember? You're worried about a little smell. Who cares about that? You're gonna get in trouble. Huh. I'm very confused by this exchange because they're both suits and stripey suit couch guy is like, you're not supposed to be here, which is what everyone's been telling the guy with the six foot sword on his back. But it turns out he was actually talking to the guy in the gray suit standing up and he's telling the guy in the gray suit, you're supposed to be dealing with the smell coming from the bathroom. A guy wearing a suit like that is supposed to be dealing with the bathroom? What? It's very confusing. That exchange is very confusing. <laughs> what about you? What do you have to say, buddy? Yes, what is it? I don't recognize you. What department did you say you were from? Um, apparently I'm from janitorial services where we can wear whatever goofy outfit we want. Yes, what is it? Aha! Uh -huh. A bathroom, okay. you say? I'll wait out here. Tifa, it's it's huh? just a bathroom. You can't hang out here. Tifa, it'd be better if you waited it's inside. It's much safer in there. Maybe, but this is... Oh, never mind. You're right. In we go. Reconnaissance time. I need some oh, secret spy God. music. No one's in here. Love to show them what the ones down below look like. Come on. Let's just find that duct. The bathrooms down below? Oh, that looks like an air vent. I mean, these bathrooms are pretty nice, I'll be honest. I like these these rectangular sinks quite a bit. Okay. You know what? I I know this is set in Midgar, but I think we can all agree it's got very Japanese influences. I feel like this toilet would be a fancy bidet. I'm just saying, this is like the Shinra building. I feel like all of these toilets would have bidets on them. I'm glad we all agree on that. Are we gonna, what? Are we gonna grapple up to this air vent? What? No. Gotcha. That would be silly. No, we're not grappling. Okay, I saw that was the icon that they used for grappling, and so I was like, "What?" But we're we're good. We're good. Look, I'm on guard duty. Right. So, Aww. can I go with you? Don't want to be here any longer than I have to. Hmm. Yeah, sure. Just follow behind. Clearly, Tifa has never had a situation herself where she's had to use the bathroom really badly, but the line for the ladies' room is super, super long, but there's no line for the men's room, so you just go in there. Clearly, she's never had that experience, otherwise she wouldn't be so massively uncomfortable in the men's restroom. It's just a toilet. Girls know. Girls know that women's restroom lines are always way too long for no reason. This is a very slow climb through these vents and I'm guessing I'm probably not going to 
see any treasure chests? No, Cloud, turn around! Oh no, we've made a huge mistake. This is a sneaky loading screen if I've ever seen one. But my goodness, this is so slow. I really do want some takey takes in here though. What, what would I find? in an air vent. Like, what treasure would I find in an air vent besides, like, dead bugs? Wait, wait, listen. Listen to what's going on there. I'm sure they're safe. But we live right by Sector 7, and I keep calling and calling, but I still can't get through. I heard that all the phone lines are down. It doesn't mean anything. You sure? Pretty sure. That's sad. It's a good thing he's not loudly clambering through Depending these air ducts the or anything. Depending on the board's decision, we may start two projects simultaneously. Rebuilding the plate and the city. Members of the Urban Planning Division will likely take point on both. Director Tuesti has ordered teams to come up with three, five, and ten year plans. Each team needs to come up with a detailed proposal and schedule. I'm already bored with this corporate meeting. We're going to have to put a meeting. lot of man hours into this, so we'll need to start ASAP. Does anyone have any questions at all? If not, then we'll wait for the director to return. This isn't a very realistic corporate board meeting because I imagine he would have been like, does anybody have any questions? And one person would have raised their hand and then said, I don't have a question so much as I have a comment. I just want to let you know that I really am glad that we're coming up with a plan to fix the plate. I think it's a good idea to fix the plate and Sector 7 at the same time. Um... Because <laughs> that's always how that goes. And... One more comment before we leave this air vent. Look at this purple suit! Look at this guy with the purple suit. I love him. And I want that suit. I would wear the heck out of that suit. And I would look pretty dang good in it, if I do say so myself. Alright, so we know we're supposed to head right here. But I have to look to the left, but I can't... Look! I just want to look. I just want to know. I have to have proof that there's nothing interesting there. I have to have proof. You know me. I'm an exhaustive game player. If I do say so myself, I had to look. And look how I got rewarded. Take. Wait a minute. Take. It's an HP up. Oh, I love it. I love a good HP up materia. I am pleased with myself, especially because this was a very boring, slow vent adventure. Adventure. <laughs> I am, I am exquisitely punny. That was a good one. That was a really good one. This it? I mean, it's gotta be. This is the end of the map. I'm telling you, I saw him. With my own eyes, sauntering down the corridor. We don't have time for this nonsense. Ah. He was as close to me as you are now. The, the shock of it made me spill my tea. Enough already! If there are intruders in the building, my men will deal with them. But, Mr. President, sir, I swear to you... Reeve. Sir, 
I have the damage assessment for Sector 7, and I'm afraid the figures are catastrophic. Spare us the doom and gloom. Uh, was there anything else? Uh, well, sir, I've also drafted that a reconstruction plan needed. for... Huh? Not with the Ancient in our custody once more. Uh, with respect, sir, Two I don't see words, how... words, Reeve. <sighs> Neo Midgar. <laughs> In their promised land, we will build a new Mako powered metropolis. Mr. President, we still don't know for sure that the promised land even. <sighs> Professor Hojo. The test results were within expectations. The specimen is somewhat lacking compared to her pure-blood mother, but for our purposes, she should more than suffice. So she can lead us to the Promised Land? Well, Mr. President, that remains to be seen. I would like your permission to secure her cooperation through more forceful means. Forceful, yet gentle. Right! She is a precious resource that must be handled with care. Forceful, yet gentle. Personally, I've never had a problem with torture. No one doubts that, Scarlet. Your disposal, should you require anything. I had something more psychological in mind. Better to scar the psyche than mar the flesh. <laughs> Ew. He's creepy too. Putting butter in his tea. Proceed as you see fit. However, you will not make the same mistake twice. Is that clear? If I may, Mr. President, I have an idea how we might mitigate the risks. Simply put, we could have the Ancient reproduce. In the absence of a second specimen, we would need to identify an alternative mate. I would start with candidates from Soldier. These would, of course, include S and G types. Quite frankly, there's no telling what kind of properties a crossbred specimen might possess. So, what say you all? <sighs> it's pretty creepy. If there is nothing else, Mr. President, meeting adjourned. <laughs> Please, sir. Something stinks. It's the bathroom. <laughs> Anything? The man in the lab coat. Head of R&D. We follow him. Okay. And then we kill the son of a bitch. Yeah. Not until he's led us to Aerith. Well. That's the plan. Yeah. I feel like, <clears throat> and I may be a little biased here, but I feel like there is nothing more violating and dehumanizing than Hojo's suggestion to breed her. Like, crossbreed her. Like, she's some kind of, like, GMO plant. It, it's so dehumanizing. It's so a lack of a recognition that she is a person with feelings. And I think it's exceptionally, exceptionally evil. So I kind of like the way that he's written because he it makes you hate him so much because we love Aerith so much. That Hojo. Hmm. 
What you doing, Barrett? Why are you just standing here? Okay. Good talk. Tifa, what are you doing? Alright, let's go follow him. Oh, we're following him into... Ah! How convenient! He's alone, just standing here. Walking the halls of this very building. Who would have believed it? Oh, Hojo would have believed I it. I wonder... Hmm... Were I to arrange a face-to-face... -face, <laughs> how I should like to meet their offspring. Ah, uh, but that can wait. First, we must have answers. A simple psychoactive agent should suffice. Nothing likely to cause any long-term damage. <laughs> Let's go. Right. <clears throat> so, <clears throat> I'm a little confused here. So, so Palmer says, I swear he's walking the halls of this very building. And for a second, it kind of makes you think he's talking that he saw Cloud. Because we know Cloud is walking around in this building like he shouldn't be. But he's also with Tifa and Barrett. However, we know that there was someone else that Palmer may have seen. A.K.A. Sephiroth. And so maybe that's what he's talking about. Because then Hojo comes in and he's like, hmm, walking the halls. Who'd have thought if I could arrange a face-to-face? -face? And then talking about their offspring, especially because of that note he was like a soldier. Like all of these things kind of like tying up into one is super, super interesting. Really, really creepy. The mystery, the intrigue. All of it is going to come to a T. I can feel it. Mm-hmm. What do we have here? Two antidotes. Interesting. What do we have here? Potions on sale for me. I'll take them. Take. And just for fun, just for fun, we'll just take these two Phoenix Downs because at this point, I'm a Phoenix Down collector. You never use them. You never take them out of the box and play with them. I'm a collector of Phoenix Downs. Is there anything else fun going on here? Uh-huh. Uh-huh, uh-huh, uh-huh. Would be the answer no. Some fun things. Uh-huh. Oh, I like the accessories everyone's wearing already. Um, the only thing I kind of might be interested in buying is because I found out that we only have one fire materia and we might want a second one. So because it's cheap, we've got the gill. I think we'll just buy it and then if we find that we need it, we'll have it. Because then you have it. Now, are we going to sell this extra all these extra bangles yes we are so many bangles we got two cog bangles that we're never going to use typical okay we don't need a bulletproof vest and a survival vest even though it's not going to gain us anything to get 400 gil we're going to sell it Everything else we'll just keep for fun, even though, you know, what's the point? Okay. Great. And we'll sit on the bench, not because we need to, but because we want to. And right there, 
is where we're going to end today's video. I hope you loved it so, so much because as you can tell, I'm loving this playthrough. I knew I would love this playthrough, you knew I would love this playthrough, but it really is exceptionally enjoyable. So please leave me a comment and let me know what your favorite part of today's video was. Please remember to like the video if you enjoyed it. Share it with all your friends so they can enjoy it too. And of course, please remember to subscribe and hit the notification bell for Strange Rebel Gaming so you don't miss the next video. That's all. I love you all.